G'day everybody, welcome along to today's vlog and you might guess from behind me, it's a grocery haul vlog today. It uh, didn't come real easy, this particular one. Click and collect and it didn't go through so I ended up having to go up to the supermarket and basically put it through like a normal shop. But anyway, we've got it here and now I'm going to go through with you what we've got for next week's meal plan, which has already been put in. Rachel's got it up there on the fridge, it's all put in place. Before we get into this, I'll just make the caveat that this is definitely a shop, that well, Rachel's done the shop, but she's done it more along the lines of easily prepared or pre-prepared foods. Hi guys, I'm home alone again on a Friday. I just got back from dropping Elliot and Sebi off. I am going to do a Coles grocery shop online. Even though it's not time yet, I'll do it for next week because I have a deal running out today where I get 10 times flybys points. My budget for the week is $350, which means I will get 3,500 flybys points. And that's a bit too good to pass up. But as well as that, we've got the new Flyby stoneware promotion started, so I want to quickly get those points so I can get the really big dish. I know there's been a lot of hype around this promotion. You're gonna to need to be quick to get the whole set this time. There's only a couple of things I really, really want, but one is 80 points, but I have to do it all by 11 a.m. I've got a quickly meal plan for next week because if I don't do it by 11 a.m., then I miss the cutoff line for pickup today and then my 10 times flybys points won't apply. So I'm gonna get stuck into meal planning next week and I will just enjoy the quiet while I do that. Let's just begin with the milk. So we picked up five times three liters of full cream milk this week, two orange juices, two two liters of apple juice and two two liters of the apple black currant fizzy drink, four times cola, two times pineapple, one raspberry lemon, a lemonade, and an orange, lots of different flavors to get us through the next week. So there's all of our drinks, fresh fruit and vegetables, because Rach did the shopping, we got some. <laughs> we did order two kids packs of bananas, but they substituted for, for one, obviously they only had one pack, so we got the normal bananas as well. We've got half a cabbage, which is half a cabbage too much in my view, but anyway. Some gourmet Australian tomatoes, two bags of Australian seedless white grapes, one kilo of pears, a kilo of Granny Smith apples, a whole watermelon, but it's not as big as the normal watermelons we buy. So we've got a whole watermelon here, so it's a smaller size watermelon this week. We've got some Australian pork beef bolognese mints, a half a kilo of that. We did order beef, but this was a substitute. And we've got the 24 pack of barbecue sausages, 1.27 kilos here of Australian drumsticks, chicken drumsticks. The Australian pizza blend shredded cheese, 700 grams there of the shredded cheese. And back down here to the uh, mild Hungarian salami. So this will be obviously for lunches for school lunches for the most part I would think. And also we have the English style sliced ham. A family coleslaw salad kit. This is already pre-prepared. These are very handy when you, you know, don't want to be at things to be taking too long. So simply a $4 pre-prepared salad kit. Some avocado dip. Okay, so moving into some snacks here. We have five pack of jumpies times four of those. These are on special, so we loaded up on those. Another four packs of five grain waves, sour cream and chives. Packet of 30 Ziploc sandwich bags. Two kilos of white long grain rice. 20 pack of garbage bags. Two 500 gram packs of spaghetti. Got a Deodorant here, that's one of the girls, or Rach. We have two 500 gram packs of olive oil spread, a dozen large free range eggs. Some vegetarian fare, so this will be obviously for ebony. We've got some firm tofu. Mixed garden vegetable koftas. We've got some lemon lime bitters. So these are one of Rach's favorite drinks. 40 pack of band-aids. 
Three packs of butter flavor popcorn, microwave popcorn. Eight packs times two of the Arnott's barbecue shapes, which are the best flavor by quite a stretch in my opinion. We have six pack of Nutri-Grain original bars times two packs, so 12 of those. A six pack of the LCM split sticks, 10 pack of Milo bars, and a 24 pack of, well they're called rainbow sticks, but they're like fruit flavored. So you got apricot, strawberry, orange, and raspberry, which are, they're quite nice. Especially the apricot ones. And we also have the seven pack of Arnott's mini choc chip cookies. Two of the Canton sweet and sour sauce. Campbell spaghetti sauce, this makes dad's pasta. Three tins of baked beans. Sandwich pickles, spreadable. And we've got some sauce here, some peri-peri, as well as some garlic aioli. Both very nice. Looks to be 10 packs of the vanilla yogurt pouches for the boys, school and kinder. Six pack of Coles jam donuts. And we got a 10 pack, multi-pack of mini monkeys. Just a single pack of baby wipes. Just referencing the baby wipes, for the first time last night, Sebi didn't wear a night nappy to bed and he didn't wet the bed. Elliot hasn't been wearing nappies for quite some time. We're only going through a few nappies, one nappy a day. And therefore we don't need anywhere near as many baby wipes for cleaning. That'll last quite a while. We didn't get nappies. And so we're not gonna need them pretty much going forward for the next four to six weeks anyway. <laughs> We've got this tiny, tiny little window where we won't be needing to buy wipes and nappies for, for a little one. The good thing is we won't have double ups. We won't we need to buy two sizes of, or two different kinds of nappies uh, for a newborn and for, for Sebi, because he'd be out of nappies. Anyway, back to what we've got here. So a new 1.2 kilo value pack of wheat bix We've got a dozen cinnamon donuts, lemon cake, pack of lamington fingers, an 18 pack and another pack of chocolate chip cookies. 500 grams of sour cream, 24 Australian tasty cheese slices, 300 grams of traditional bacon pieces, and some Devon. That's it, that's what we have for next week. weeks worth of food and we've got on the fridge here we've got the full list of meals that we're gonna have so starting with Monday with breakfast lunch and dinner all outlined here for us that said the kids will always ask and I must admit I often will go to Rach and say what are we doing for dinner and she's like I put it all up on the fridge. You don't need to come and ask me. But sometimes they just like, and the kids are the same. We we do it. So, but it's put here so Rach doesn't have to answer the same question ten times because you can imagine everyone in the house coming through, cycling through, and asking, "What's for dinner, Mum? What's for dinner, Mum?" <laughs> all right, so we're set for next week. We've got everything we need. Things are a little bit tougher at the moment because Rach just has to rest up, and that's just yeah. the way it is. But it's only a short period. Everybody's got to pitch in. The kids are pitching in. Obviously, Rach will need recovery time as well. So we've just got to get ourselves through this period of time. We've done it before. We've done it twice before as a family, as a large family. We're going to be just fine. I'm just on my phone. I'm here to pick up Elliot at the school. I came early so I could park close enough so I don't have to walk too far. We rang Coles because I really wanted that 10 times flybys. So we had to make sure that we got the order in today. Yep, no worries, you can come in and pick it up still. I just got an email, 20 times flyby points if I shop in the next three days. Ugh. So yeah, missed out on that one, but maybe I'll do a stockpile shop. I'll have a think about it. Okay, well thanks for watching guys, for being a part of today's vlog. Until tomorrow, hooray mate.